When the NFL returned to Baltimore in 1996, the new franchise needed an identity, a cornerstone. And with their first ever draft pick, they got that and so much more. What Ray Lewis was to the Ravens on defense, Jonathan Ogden was on the offensive side of the ball. He became an instant leader in the locker room and on the field. I got him with a nice little rib shot. He was a mountain of a man, six foot nine, 350 pounds. But what really defined him was his athleticism. He moved entire lines, opened up stunning gaps in defenses, and elevated the Ravens' running game to a new level. Jamal Lewis was the prime beneficiary of Ogden's greatness. With 2003 as the most extreme example, Lewis rushed for over 2,000 yards, 295 of them on one record-breaking day against the Browns. And the primary cog in that wheel was Ogden, imposing his will at the line of scrimmage. With Ogden serving as a franchise bedrock, the Ravens earned their first Super Bowl appearance in January of 2001, and behind Ogden, controlled the line of scrimmage, thrashing the New York Giants 34-7. Befitting a player of his magnitude is Ogden's list of accolades. A nine-time All-Pro, 11-time Pro Bowler, a nine-time All-AFC selection, the NFL Alumni's Offensive Lineman of the Year in 2002, a member of the NFL's All-Decade Team of the 2000s, and at 39 years old, the youngest member of the Hall of Fame. Oh yeah, that's that old veteran move, Sam, that's that old veteran move. But more than any individual honor, Ogden's impact can be measured on the Ravens franchise itself. A city that once found itself abandoned by the NFL reinvented its sports image through the bold, powerful Ravens. By re-establishing Baltimore as one of the most prominent spots on the NFL landscape, Jonathan Ogden ushered in a new era for a team and for the city where he played.